what happened. I mean, I know that I'm, I'm, I'm happy that they caught him. I'm glad the streets didn't catch him. But I'm also confused on you saying that you were being carjacked. You know, and in the video, if you see it, it's it's showing that you were staying, you had stayed there. So why didn't you stay there when the cops got there and explain to them exactly what happened? You know, now you had them looking for you, trying to figure out who you are, wasting time when you could have just said all that from the beginning, and then they wouldn't be after you. They'll be after the person who was carjacking you or whatever you know was going on. These little girls could be dead. We could be planning a funeral right now instead of you know helping Ladariana really get better because Alasia she got minor stuff you know she didn't get the you know full impact she hurt her leg and everything but this baby that's in that hospital she's going through a lot she's going through physical therapy every day all that pain that's a lot mm -hmm. you know and not even the, the the physical pain but the emotional pain you know when she gotta think of this stuff over and over again once somebody explained her her excuse me and she's seeing these videos you know, and then hearing everybody talking and all the news reporters and everything, and she gotta get she gotta get back to her regular normal life, and this is something that can affect her for the rest of her life. You know? Do you believe this story? Now they say he did not stay until the cops. You do see him stay, mm -hmm. but they say he didn't stay because someone came out the house with a gun. I, when I got there, I didn't see any guns. I didn't hear any guns. I just when I got there. It was a lot of commotion. I, my concern was Alasia. Uh, once I got her situated in the ambulance and then everybody was calling with everything else and we finally seen the video, you know, the uncut version and it was like, oh my God. And I seen this gentleman, but my nephews kept saying that he was the driver, he was the driver. He was the one that got out the car and I was like, no, it's the guy. You know, we kept seeing a guy with the white pants get out, but we didn't see anything, anybody else. But once we seen the video of the gentleman that was caught and I looked and I said yeah he was there but if this was the case you were being carjacked why didn't you stay when the police got there and explain the situation you ran you had them looking for you for days why even if you left the scene and you felt like your life was in you know being threatened police station right there when you seen the cops come back why didn't you come back and say look officer I was at the scene, someone came out with a gun, I felt, I feared for my life, and I ran. I'm back to tell you exactly what happened, you know? But you didn't do that. You made them look, actually look for you. You made them have to do fingerprints and all the stuff that they had to do to actually find you. Mm -hmm. That's not fair. That's not fair at all.